It can be addictive, compulsive, an easy hit. The fixed odds betting terminal, a high stakes fruit machine, a real money spinner for betting shops. On Friday, the gambling industry announced a voluntary code of conduct, including limits to the amount of money and time customers spend. The government says that code will now become compulsory, and it's also looking at making it tougher. It's asked the industry regulator, the Gambling Commission, to look at other ways gamblers could be protected. They include a warning message to appear straight away, telling customers to stay in control and play responsibly. Forcing gamblers to set spending limits and a time duration before they start playing. And if bookmakers want a license to operate, they'll have to accept the mandatory rules. Those who've had gambling problems want to see things go even further. We actually think that the best route would be a stake reduction to make the product less harmful. So at the moment you can bet £100 every 20 seconds and we think that should come down to £2 to bring, all ga bring them in line with other gaming machines in the UK. The Association of British Bookmakers has welcomed the government's plans, saying they want to focus on helping the small number who have problems with betting without impacting on the millions who gamble safely. Daniela Ralph, BBC News.